Good morning, guys and girls. It's Stacey here with another episode of Stardew Valley. And guess what? It is the first of spring, summer, summer. That's the one. We're in summer now. So we've got plenty of things to do today. But first, I just want to give you guys a little bit of an update about how things have been going with the channel. Because you may have noticed that I didn't have an episode out on Monday. And the reason for that is, like, I, like I've been saying for the last, you know, few months, I've moved to a new city, had a new job. And pretty much um, I went home for Easter, so halfway across the country, and then, um, yeah, I had the week from hell at work last week, and then my parents came to visit, so I was dealing with them all of this last weekend, and now I've got a friend sleeping on my couch. So pretty much it's been hard to keep up with the whole YouTube channel thing and still get some sleep. I have not had enough sleep. <laughs> the fire alarm in my building is also faulty, so it keeps going off at 3 o'clock in the morning, which is really great. So, yeah, that's why we didn't have an episode on Monday, uh, and why this one is going up late. But Stardew Valley is probably not going to be too affected. This is the one game that's pretty easy to record, because, like, I turn on recording, I play. So, yeah, Stardew Valley should be back to normal schedule. I'm going to pre-record the next, like, two weeks' worth of episodes. Um, so, yeah, hopefully nothing will be missing from now on. Can't say the same for other games. Um, I will do a placeholder for tomorrow's Minecraft video and explain what's going on with that. But, yeah, most of the people watching this are Stardew Valley people, so you guys don't really care about Minecraft. So I'm going to stop talking now, and we are going to look into... Is that going to automatically dig up those? No. We are going to start planting our summer crops. But now, it's already 11 o'clock, so we've fed and watered our animals. And yeah, 11 o'clock, I was hoping to hit the beach at 12. Got to work on my summer tan. Also, got to try and catch puff fish. So there's very few things we've got left to do in terms of fish. We've got puff fish, we've got super cucumber, which we can also catch at the beach today. Um, and we've got a few special fish. But yeah, so pretty much we're restricted to... Oh, and we have to go visit Pierre too. Right. How did we end up with extra garlic seeds? I don't even know. Alright, pretty much we're restricted to... I've just completely forgotten what I was going to say. Okay, let me sort my stuff out and we'll go chat to Pierre. Okay, here we are at Pierre's. So what can we get? We need melons. Let's get a full thing of these. Uh-oh. That is not ideal. I guess we are buying our seeds tomorrow. Uh, mm, yeah, I kind of, I don't want to plant those and not be able to, you know, not harvest them all at the same time. I guess I could sell the bread. Better get us to 120. I'd still be one short. I need to be at 160. Alright, so I guess we're not going to plant any seeds. We're going to sell a lot of stuff tomorrow and hopefully that'll be enough. Alright, let's head on down to... Maybe there'll be something in the bins. We'll head on down to the beach, start working on our tan and start seeing if we can get that puffer fish. Okay, so it says beach east side. I don't know if it means I have to go over to the bit on the other side of the fence there, or if this bit will be fine. I'm not entirely sure, but we're going to give it a go. And if we don't catch a piff, if we don't get a puffer fish today, then we'll know that we need to go to the other area. So yeah, I'm going to stand here and do some fishing. Okay, well it's now four o'clock, which means we're not going to be able to get the puffer fish tonight. I reckon we can sell these fish to Willy because we don't want to keep them, and we'll sell him some bait as well. And I reckon, yeah, we've now got enough money. If we make a mad dash to Pierre's, we'll be able to get the pumpkins on time. The melon seeds on time. Let's just quickly... Alright. Let's go. Can we get to Pierre's before five? Get out of my way, Lewis. Come on. 4.30. 4.40. I don't have time to get stuck. Out of my way, Evelyn. Yes! Yes! Made it to his counter. Okay! 
with 477 things left, we really don't have the money to buy anything else today. But just so for future reference, what do we need? We're going to want... We're going to want to buy the ones that re like make more crops throughout the season. So we want to buy tomatoes, we want to buy blueberries, we want to buy peppers. Okay, so 100 times that, so we're going to need 5,000, we're going to need 8,000, we're going to need 4,000. Wow, we're up to 17,000 already. Uh, wheat, we'll want that as well, but not as a priority, because we can do it any time. Um, hops, we'll want 20 of them. And corn, 150 gold. We're going to need $15,000 for that. Yeesh. That's... <sighs> okay. We need to go make some cash. <laughs> okay, we've got all of our melon seeds planted. We've got one fresh iridium sprinkler that we can just plonk down there. There, thank you. I'm going to fill up this watering can again before the end of the day. Because, you know, that seems to be like a good thing to do. Oh, got to water the hops. Let me fill up the watering can again. Um, I think we may as well... Oh, I'm not really sure it's worth the effort to hoe the rest of the ground. Because, I mean, we could. We could. But chances are it would just not... It would, like, unhoe overnight. And that just would make it not really worth it. Let's just get some grass, though. Because we're going to have to feed our animals at some point. So we need to get as much grass in there as, well, as possible. I think we really actually need to buy another silo. Now we've got so many animals. Alright, we must have filled it up. Okay, well, I'm going to go and sell a bunch of stuff, and I'll be right back with you. Alright, it's 10.30 in the morning, and it is time to hit up Pierre, because we have $14,000 to play with, which is not enough. It's nowhere near enough. But it will at least get us blueberries and maybe some other things. We'll, we'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. So, blueberries. Yep, that's taken up most of our money. Uh, $6,000 left. Um, tomatoes or peppers? We can only do one. I think... Hmm... Yeah, we definitely can't do any corn. Hops. It would be nice to have 20 of those. And that takes us down to 5,300. So we... We could do tomato still. I'd love to do some of these other things, but I think it's important to get the tomatoes in. So let's do that first, and then we'll do peppers tomorrow. And, yep, that's left us with about $500. We could sell all of this, but we're not going to be able to earn enough to get the peppers that we want. So, not much point. Besides, we'll then have three crops growing, which is, you know, it's still a fair amount. Oh, uh, I possibly did. The quality was decent. Uh, that's, that's nice, Evelyn. Thanks. Um, I'm just gonna quietly go riffle through your bin. Alright, we're gonna have another go. Ooh, hello. Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. We're gonna have another go at catching puffer fish. I did not check to see what the spirits were up to today, but yesterday when I had a bit of a look, when I came back... Wait. Ten of... What? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I... How am I 10 out of 10 with Haley? I'm only 8 out of 10 with Haley. I am confused. Um... Yeah, that is, that is odd. That is really weird. Oh well. Uh... Great. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Right. Cutscene. Cutscene. Right. Okay. Uh, what have we got? We've got Alex. Sniff. 
Okay. He's crying. Why do you cry, Alex? Oh well, yeah. Well, nothing wrong with that. Everyone gotta cry sometime. That's a pretty legit reason to cry. Salted radish sandwiches. Okay, yep, that's interesting. Not so much my thing, but, you know, yep. That's really sweet. Look. I remember being at the funeral of one of my mum's friends and I was, you know, really good friends with their kids growing up. It was like one of those family things that you just, yeah. And, I mean, for years and years afterwards, the kids would just post on Facebook that they missed their mum on the anniversary of her death, which is, you know, it's really sad. And when they got married, she wasn't there. I mean, she was dead, so she couldn't be, obviously. Yeah, anyway, really tragic. So, poor old Alex. I, like... You know, luckily for me, I don't exactly know what he's going through, but I can sympathize. Well, there we go. Uh, get over it, life is hard. Well, yeah, but, you know, you can't tell people how to grieve. And... Yeah, that's a thing. That's exactly it. You do the best that you can do and nobody can do any better I mean well some people's best might be different to your best but if you've put your best in then you can feel confident that you've done everything you can do anyway yeah did this game get a little bit emotional here and there Alex 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 okay listen it's okay to cry what? Why is my character laughing? No! No. Okay, like, if you're a guy and you're watching this and you think it's not okay to cry, you're wrong. It's fine to cry. And if anybody gives you a hard time about it, they're not the kind of person you want in your life. It is absolutely fine for men, women, anybody to cry. This is... This is a thing that I actually feel fairly strongly about because, you know, I have... Like I've said in earlier videos, I had had a friend that's passed away through depression and, you know, if there was less of a stigma around men being strong and tough, maybe he would have considered getting some more help. Anyway, that's speculation. Let's not go there. We're fishing. Oh my god, yes! Yes, we got him! We got him! Okay, guys, we have got our puffer fish. Which means that we can now complete... Okay, no. We can't. No, wait! I swear we got some sandfish the other day. Uh, yeah, we got sandfish the other day. We can complete the fish tank. I know we've got it somewhere. We could also technically go and give it to Pierre, but... I don't think that we will. Oh, I completely forgot about that. Pierre wanted sashimi. Okay, well, we can worry about that later. That should be really easy. We should be able to do that. All right, why don't we go back to... Oh, let's uh, just empty and refill these crab pots. Say hello to Leah. And say hello to Sam. Do I... Well, sure. Um, do I have a gift for you? Uh, uh, how about some oak resin? No? Okay. Alright, let's go plant those crops and let's go to the community centre and see if we can get the fish bundle finished. Alright guys, and to finish off the episode today, we are finally going to just finish off this fish bundle. So we'll chuck in the puff fish, we'll chuck in a sandfish. Bundle complete! Yes! Glittering boulder removed. I don't actually know what that's all about. Dish of the sea. Oh, useful. Okay. We'll need that when we try and catch the summer legendary. 
Oh, yep, yeah, things are happening, things are happening. Hello, hello guys. Hey. So, like, all I need to do now is the bulletin board, I think. Yeah, that's, that's looking good. Where's the little guy with the star? Uh, do I not get a star today? I'm pretty sure I get a star. If I walk outside and walk back in... Yeah, there's a star, so it glitched out again. And now it's just the bulletin board guy. Okay, well, let's go to bed and let's see what they do. And then we'll finish up. And here we go. So what are they doing? This is a glittering boulder. What? What is happening? They're doing something to it. Could not see. I sold that parsnip wine, by the way. It was pretty gross. Who would want parsnip wine? Really? Ew. Anyway, guys, I think this is where we're going to leave it for today. So if you like this episode, please leave a like. If you really loved it, make sure to subscribe. And like I said before, I know things have been a bit up and down lately, but things should be getting back to normal schedules soon. So you will see videos every Monday and Thursday from now on is my hope. So yeah, thanks very much guys for watching and for sticking with me even when the schedule gets a little bit messed up. And yeah, I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.